Well, it's a stormy creamer kind of day today. Look at them, look at them trees. You ain't seen anything yet. I mean, it's slacked off now. Yesterday was 40 to 70. We had some 80 some mile hour winds at the tunnel. But it's cooking. Oh, look. The ravens are back. Eagles. There's another one. Eating Chris's birdseed. We're going to do some reconnaissance here on the bay where I live. Then we're going to take a ride. Do some more reconnaissance. We're going to try to go for a spin this afternoon. Let's see how it goes. Well, it's rough as bricks. I told you it's rough as bricks. God knows. Woo, baby. This is right here where I live on the bay. Look how rough it is. Great balls of fire. I'm headed to the cave. See what the cave looks like. I've been to the cave in six months, I don't think. Since they pumped all that sand on there, nobody's been hunting. It's been, you know, 10 foot of sand, 90 foot wide. But I'll take a look at it and see what it looks like. I gotta pick up some knives anyway in town here. I'll get back to you when I get there and see what that baby looks like. I'm curious. Oh. Mumbles man went to the Nada. I think I told you already. He found uh, ring number 22, uh, Junker. Or I think he said Junker. I'll put the pictures at the end here so you can see them. And like I said, I'm pretty sure we're going to go this afternoon when the tide drops off. What little it'll drop off with all this wind. It won't drop off much, but some. All right, I'll get back to you. Oh, my, Mal, my buddy in Mal says, I watched one of his videos. He said it's rough over there, too. He called it. He used a Scottish term for real windy. He said it's blowing in Holland. Blowing in Holland. <laughs> or something like that. I thought it was pretty cool. He didn't say it like that. But that's what it says. But his accent, it was pretty nice. I'll get back to you. Still no cave. Covered up, no sign of it anywhere. You can see that thing right there, that's where the start of it is. That manhole right there. I'm headed back to Rancho Max now. I just picked up the three knives that I had to pick up while I was in this area. Three nice Victor Knox knives. Big slicer, chef's knife, and a boner. Victor Knox, my favorite knife for the money. I know you guys don't like knives, but some of you do. And now, while we're sitting in this light, I need to discuss something. I'll bring something that a lot of people on YouTube 
don't particularly care for, but they don't understand it. I use the term meager a lot, as you that follow me and know, meager. A meager, a meager this or a meager that. That was a meager piece of copper or a meager, it, meager, M-E-A-G-E-R, meager. But I guess a lot of people can't hear me say meager and they take it for the derogatory term that starts with N. And I get a lot of flack on that. Well, for you dumb asses out there that can't understand me, it is meager, meager. I'll see you later. There's the Victor knockers I picked up. Dollar for dollar, my favorite knife ever for the money. You cannot beat them. It's this kind of day in the land of Rancho Max. Believe me.